During 2019, the Toyota RAV4 underperformed in the Moose test twice. Uh, and uh, since then, Toyota has said they're gonna do something about the car. We've tried to test the car previously in Sweden in November. Didn't work because of uh, wet weather. But now we're in Spain to see how it performs. This car doesn't look at all like the test cars we drive back home. Can you explain a little bit about this aluminum construction on the side? Yeah, it's, uh, the outriggers here is to help the car so it can't roll over. Uh, and uh, the weight of them is about the same as the rear doors. So it, it's, uh, well, it doesn't make the car heavier or something. But the car is still loaded as, as it should have been back home. Max load, yes, but there is one difference put back home. Back home we have people in the rear, so you feel, when you're driving, you feel first the car come, and then you feel the persons moving in the back. Uh, so this, uh, with this way to have the weight is a little bit easier for the car. But it's still okay. It's much better than it was home in Sweden and it has passed the limit that we accept. So it's okay. So the updated RAV4, what have you done with it? Uh, we tuned uh, VSC. VSC is a vehicle stability control. Uh, we tuned VSC more strong uh, parameter. So in practical, much more braking from the system? Yes, correct. Is that the only difference uh, compared to the car we tested uh, almost a year ago? Yes, only software change. We feel that the car performs much better now. What do you feel? Uh, do you also feel it performs better now? Yes, better now. The Toyota RAV4 is now approved uh, in Technik & Sverige's Moose test. It performs at 72 km an hour with a much better working VEC system and no wheel lifts. Uh, altogether a safer behavior through the Moose test. That is good. Uh, a question mark though for the upgrades that Toyota has uh, brought into this car. It won't be uh, put into production. You as a car owner has to ask for this update yourself. So if you're one of the 115,000 customers of RAV4's to this date, you have to go to your Toyota dealer and ask for this upgrade. And it will be available sometime during the second quarter of 2020. So uh, keep in touch with your local Toyota dealer.